Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to activate your Maya Mobile eSIM. Now, having an eSIM on your phone is crucial if you plan to travel to a country or a foreign country, then you need to have an eSIM or a network uh, for calls and internet in this country. So purchasing an eSIM for your destination country is crucial to stay online and be available for calling. Now, of course, one thing before I start this video is that you need to make sure that your phone supports eSIM functionality. Now, most modern phones do support eSIM. However, it's beneficial to at least do a Google search on your mobile phone uh, model and if it supports eSIM. So for example, my phone is iPhone 13. I search on Google, does iPhone 13 support eSIM? Okay, enter. And Google will tell you that it has eSIMs. Okay, or it does support two eSIMs here. Now, um, let's go back to Maya Mobile. And the first thing you need to know is to uh, know the country to which you want to go or your destination country. So let's see here, I am traveling, for example, to the United States. Uh, here, tap on the United States USA Plus, click on plans and pricing. And here, choose a plan that works better for you. Of course, you will need to choose the number of days or the time period where you'll be in the United States. So it's, you're going to stay for five days, 10 days, 15 or 13 days. Let's say I'm going to stay for 15 days and these are the plans. Now here, of course, they give you for each plan, you have the data that is available for you. So for this plan, for example, you have three gigabytes of data and uh, this plan five gigabytes, 20 up to an unlimited plan. So the unlimited plan here, you have unlimited data on T-Mobile, AT&T and also 5G. And here you can see other plans here, additional plans. You have unlimited plans for solo traveling and for Wi-Fi sharing and for streaming. So you have here multiple plans that you can choose from. Now, let's say I only need 40 gigabytes, which is plenty for my for me and click on activate now, activate the plan. And of course, here you need to uh, decide your plan activation day. So let's say I am going to travel uh, July 13th and the plan is 15 days. And here you can choose if you want auto recharge. So here you can, they can top off your data automatically once you reach 90% of the 40 gigabytes data. And you have each additional 40 gigabyte data package for $42. And you can change this preference at any time. And here you, you tell, you're told that it's included with your eSIM 24 seven customer service and 100% money back guarantee and also trip cancellation guarantee. So if you happen to cancel your trip for any reason, you get your money back. So here, let's say I've reviewed all these settings and this is good for me. Now review and pay. And of course here you need to create an account. So here add your first name, last name, email address, password, and your mobile number. So I'm going to enter all these details right now. And just like that, after you enter all your details, review and pay. Okay, seems like there is an error here. However, here I chose the plan options then creating the account and the last step after I create my account with all my details is to review and uh, pay for the plan amount and you'll give me the instructions on how to activate this specific eSIM and this specific plan on my phone. 